I'm really excited to talk to Ulrike Krasemann today. Ulrike, tell us a little bit about yourself and what you do. Well, thanks for having me, first of all. Um, I am a leadership coach working in Hamburg. Um, it's interesting because my path is, um, yeah, it's it's not very, very, it, it's not focused on the one hand, because I started in the marketing business. I worked there for 20 years. And, you know, retrospective, it's all, it's exactly the, the, the way of my my professional way is exactly it's perfect because it helps me so much to understand women i am a leadership coach for women in leadership so it helps me so much to understand women in any um situation so therefore this is my path used to work as a marketing pro and now i'm working as a leadership coach for women in leadership Ulrike, tell me a little bit more about your journey. How did you get to where you are today? Tell us about some pivotal moments that sort of steered you to now coaching, being a leadership coach for women in leading positions. I think it has a lot to do with my own biography. Because 20 years ago, I really felt distracted from life. And um, I started my path by doing a therapy. I had a very great therapist, a very spiritual woman here in Hamburg. And uh, this was, you know, my first steps to find myself and understand who I am. So um, I started to work with her, but, you know, I was fixed from that moment on. It took me a couple of years and then I started to work with other um, coaches, I did trainings and stuff. That was still when I worked in the marketing business, of course. And I realized that consciousness is so important and is so crucial to 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 not only act from a, from an emotional um, uh, um, yeah impulse, you can say. So. I, yeah, it, one day um, I decided, oh no, it, 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 I think it, yeah, but when I think about it, it was, um, you know, it was, it, it took me a time to realize that the marketing business, I did it very well, but it's not fulfilling myself. So I started to, you know, look around me and ask myself, what's, in for me here still what can i do how can i how can i um find my 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 power how can i support other people so i started to uh, to do a training a coaching training and several coaching trainings and i felt that this is my call my calling you can say um i understood that i'm here to you know um to bring women um, back to their holiness. Can you say that, holiness? Absolutely. So that, that's my path from my own experience. Ulrike, tell us a little bit more on your uh, coaching style. I know you've done lots of different trainings. Every one uh, coach has a sort of a bit of a different uh, approach. Tell us a bit more about a normal or sort of usual way how you go about with a new client. Mm -hmm. Sure. Well, my my focus or my method is um, the I'm working with the family dynamics. What does it mean to work with the family dyna dynamics? It means that in the first place, when I meet my my client uh, for the first time, I have this little program I developed um, during the last six, seven years. And it's to find out your patterns, the patterns of my clients, because the patterns give us an idea how we emotionally, emotionally react in certain situations. So this is the whole magic about it, because if I know um, that my unconscious behavior 
comes from an old pattern within my family, it really helps because it makes then uh, suddenly sense to, to, to transform it. And once we have found it, I help the client to transform it, to change it, because then we have, it's, we have a, a, a she, my client has a certain, she has a certain goal. So together with the goal and what I have evaluated with her, we can really, we, we have a, a um, you can say a focused path. So I can, I can guide her to her goal. That's how I work. Ulrike, and, um, and which is super interesting. And I know this comes from real experience. I mean, throughout your life, you had to do that yourself. So you know how well it works. Um, so Ulrike, what do you think is your main motivator? What is the thing that motivates you most? It's growth. I love to grow. It's such a great feeling because it's an it's an inner growth it's you know when i show myself beyond my fears because i have understood that this all comes out of a pattern and i i have the courage i'm very courageous that doesn't mean that there is no fear but the courage is bigger than my fear and i know when i when I go beyond, something really magic sometimes happens. I love that courage is bigger than the fear. Thank you for saying that. <laughs> Ulrike, what do you think is your quality, the top quality you have that you love about yourself, but that also helps you to be successful in what you do? Actually, it's, it's two things. It's, um, it's empowerment. I know that I have an empowering energy for my clients, because I really, I, 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 I celebrate them when they do next steps. And I really, I'm good. I'm very good in empowerment. And there is, it was so interesting. One of my trainers, she said in, um, um, let's think how you, uh, how I can translate it. It's, um, it's like, she said, you love people and you love it out of them. So it's not about dog being dogmatic. It's about really, I really care for my clients. I really do care. And everybody is so special. So I think that this, uh, that this combination, this inner love I have to give, it sounds cheesy, but I, I, I think you know what I mean with that, uh, combined with the, with the, um, resource of empowerment. I think this is what makes it so special. I think we need more cheesy in this world. So thank you. <laughs> Beautifully. <laughs> Ulrike, what would your top tips be? You've worked with women for many years now. What would your top tips be for women that are sort of looking for their power or need assurance or need just a little bit of support? I would say a lot of that, what you think is an illusion, it comes from a different place. And this place is your past. It's, and it's not real. Once you have understood that, that it's, it's just a voice and it's an old voice, a family voice. You can, you can decide to go out of the fear and decide for love because it's either or it's to go to you know to to it's it's the trustful way trust yourself but it's so easy to say trust yourself because we have to because if you don't if we don't know where this place is i don't have a connection to it but it's once we have understood it's an illusion we can we can open this door and we can we can make little steps. It's not about huge steps. It's about you know going, just going. Because if we start to go, 
the path comes to us. How beautiful you said that. Thank you so much. Ulrike, what are your goals, your plans, your dreams? What's in store for you? Uh, well, my absolutely dream is that uh, the, this family dynamic uh, method or this, this technique I have, I really want to... Um, I really want to shout it out because it's, I think it's it's very, very sustainable. It's a very sustainable uh, way. And I would love to be one of the, of the persons or women here to really make it um, grow and to really give it a voice. So this is my, my mission now to, to bring this, this um, message into the world that this is a very sustainable way. Thank you, Ulrike, so much for talking to me today. Thank you so much too. It was so much fun.